Hey guys, and welcome to episode 5 of Titan Tries. Today, on the examination board, we have something a little bit different. Um, something that I've actually had uh, in my library since 2004, I believe. Um, I picked this up... No, I think my dad bought it for me in a big bundle of games off one of those um, shopping channels. You remember those? And um, I've never actually given it a go, I don't think. I've never actually popped the disc in once. So, I thought, what the hell? Uh, my missus is quite a fan. In fact, um, almost unhealthy uh, obsession with this little guy. I'm, of course, talking about Lilo and Stitch. Now, I've seen the movies. Uh, at least I've seen the first one, for sure. Um, now... I thought it was pretty damn good. I am, believe it or not, quite partial to my Disney films. Um, and I really, really enjoyed uh, Lilo and Stitch. Uh, some really cool characters. Of course, you've got Lilo and Stitch, Mr. Uh, 626 himself. Um, but also, I remember, like, Cobra Bubbles and uh, hmm, the captain guy, the big guy. What was he called? I can't remember. Plinky... I don't know. We're going to get into it anyway, and we're going we're gonna to enjoy it. I did look a little bit of this up. And apparently it got like average review. I don't have the disc on me. It's actually my system. Um, I looked a bit of it up and uh, apparently it had like average reviews, which I suppose is about about right. It did come out the same year as the film, which was 2002. Can you believe that? 2002 this came out. Holy shit, that's 17 years ago. When did that happen? Ah, oh, 17 years ago. Shit. So anyway, I thought, why not have a little look at it? So what have we got on the back? On the back, we have some rather interesting art. Um, name, Experiment 626. Alias, Stitch, Distinguishing Mark, Six Arms, Sharp Teeth, Bad Attitude. Hmm. Wanted for numerous acts of wanton destruction and large-scale demolition. Suspect is abnormally strong, super intelligent. Um, and virtually indestructible. Last seen running riots through Jamba's laboratory uh, in the Greenma jungle. Hmm. Warning, approach with caution. Suspect is armed and extremely rude. <laughs> I like that. If you have any information regarding this subject, contact your local intergalactic bounty hunter. Mm -hmm. Oh, I wonder if Cobra Bubbles... <laughs> Bubbles, what a name. And of course, we have got complete with manual today, so... There's... It is a black and white uh, manual, so eh, try and get that in there. It is a black and white manual, um, but there is a lot in here, actually. And I don't really know what it's going to be like. Uh, I'm assuming that it's going to be something like um, Ratchet and Clank, I suppose, or maybe Jack and Daxter. Some kind of platform shooter. Uh, but let's have a look. Anyway, let me fire up the old PlayStation and uh, we'll have a look. There we go. Get the old PlayStation rolling. Now, this game is presented in full widescreen, which is nice. Now, as always, we're going to be completely unbiased and fair. We're going to give it a good shout. Give it a fair shout, I should say, and see how it operates. I've got a fresh PlayStation 2 memory card in there. Well, at least I hope it's a fresh PlayStation 2 memory card in there. Uh, we're going to see how that unfolds. Ooh, we could have uh, Svenska. Or we can have English. Uh, I'm going to go with English. Uh, sorry for you Svenska speakers out there, but uh, I need me some English. Sony Computer Entertainment Europe presents... Disney 2002. So this would have been like a really early PlayStation 2 game. Disney Interactive. Hmm. Danger! High voltage! Oh, don't. Don't do it. <laughs> He's so... Oh. Fucking adorable, man. <laughs> but he certainly captures his attitude. Hmm. Oh, okay, that's all we get. Ooh. 
some pretty cool presentation here. Checking memory card. No save data present on memory card. Yeah, create some data. Next time the missus comes down, we're probably going to end up playing through this, I would wager. Save complete. Oh, uh, yeah, stick it anywhere. Empty! Start a new game in this empty file. Are you sure? Well, uh, yeah. My efforts to prove myself greatest genetic scientist through experiments such as 6 to 1 have met with little success. Though I have high hopes for my latest creation, 6 to Jumbo. 6, which should develop into a perfect matching machine. Thanks to loving care of Jumba. At last! Enough DNA to power my new teleportation device. Now we can go to new worlds. We can gather different DNA samples, and I can create new genetic experiments. Mm -hmm. uh, now is the time for action. Six to six. Get moving! Okay, so we are actually working for Jumbo. Fair. I uh, oh, what was that guy's called? Oh, that was Cap. Captain Choose something. A world to explore, six to six. Oh, this is unique. Oh no, maybe not. Access denied, world one. Secrets, access denied. Okay, so we actually get a world choice. Okay, so what have we got? We've got options. Let's have a little look at the options here. Controls. Uh, invert jetpack. Oh hell. We don't need to look at the controls though. Sound, crank that shit right up's fine. I can fix it in post. Um, sure, let's go. Oh, wow, so we have levels within the worlds. Hmm. Intriguing. Okay, let's go. Hmm. Yeah, I love Ratchet and Clank and uh, Jack and Daxter, Spyro, Crash, all those old kind of platform games that you don't really get anymore. Medieval as well. Do you remember Medieval? <gasps> Oh. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, the movement's quite good. Ah, the jungle. Teeming with life. Plenty sources for DNA. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, Stitchy, my friend. Let's go. Have you, you haven't been called Stitch yet, have you? You're still uh, 66. So the graphics are for an early PlayStation 2 release. Very nice. Quite detailed character models. The worlds are a bit bland. Ooh. So X, we have like a blaster gun. We can blow shit up. <laughs> An alien toe. Your hypermetabolism will heal your wounds in no time. Well, okay. All right then. So we can. Ju we do have a double jump, which is nice. What else have we got here? And we've got our laser. That's basically all we have. So what do the shoulder buttons do? Oh, what the fuck is that? Okay, so we can like charge. Mm. You are made to be ultimate weapon, not gaze at sunset, six to six. Yeah, yeah, shut up, Jabba. Destroy. Right, let's destroy all this stuff. We're destroying it, we're destroying it, for God's sake. So we just got injured by something. Now, it feels nice and fast. No, like, slowdown or anything so far. Yeah, so explosions do hurt. So if we push start, do we have, like... We don't seem to have... Oh, okay. So we've got like DNA points, we've got a gun, which I'm guessing we can upgrade the gun, maybe? Yeah, so Metacritic gave this game like 62% or something like that, which is actually very low, but... So we've got the bouncies. Me likey bouncy, me likey bouncy. Alright, that's cool. What the hell's that little bouncy majig? Can we like waste his ass? Probably don't want to get too close to that before we blow it up. Uh, camera is a little bit strange, like on the uh, on the right stick. It kind of just rotates halfway around him and then stops. So it's not a full 360 camera, which is a little bit weird. Not sure if I like that. That's going to take some getting used to. All right, cool, cool. So I'm guessing we can't like waste these guys. And he's not. Ooh. Ah, the jungle, teeming with life. Plenty sources for DNA, no? <laughs> yeah, pretty sure you just said that, Jamba. Alright, let's go. So we can hide. Okay, so I guess we can go through there. I don't know if there's like any point in destroying all these things. Like, are we scored? I don't know! Let's just fuck everything up and stitch. 
Looks like it's lots of food hidden in all this stuff, which is cool. Uh, so far, yeah, positive. Uh, it's feeling quite positive. Ah. Okay, we've got some more DNA. I'm guessing we need to collect 30 DNA for an upgrade. Is that what that's all about? It's nice and colourful as well. I mean, it's not as nice looking as some of the newer, uh, or some of the later PlayStation 2 games, but then, you know, it's a 2002 release. The PlayStation 2 was a very, very difficult machine to program for. Um, but once the developers started getting a handle on it, they made some very nice things. Very nice looking games. Now, it was... Oh, impressive. Not in the same league as, like, the GameCube or the Xbox, but... It could make some pretty stuff. And this game's nice and smooth. Now the checkpoint is active. I can transport you to here if things get a little too rough for you. Okay, so if we die, I guess we come back there. Fair. I would like to be able to strafe. I think that would be nice. Oh, we can lock on, though. Which is cool. Fucking mosquito bug. Dude. Ah, they drop, like, hunks of alien meat. We like us some alien meat. I don't know what this this is. I don't know what that does. Should we have a look at the controls? Orpanauts. Let's have a look at the Orpanauts. And... Okay. I guess we can't look at the controls. Maybe it's worth looking at what that charge attack does. I'm guessing it's just a charge attack. DNA. Jumba needs these bits of genetic code for his experiments. So he often sends Stitch out to look for them. Collecting DNA will open up other worlds and help you complete your goals. Okay. Alien tote. These mutated alien totes may look may not look appetizing, but try to gobble as many as you can. Each one will restore a bit of Stitch's health. Okay. Stitch's moves. Normal. Stitch can get around just fine on two of his six limbs, allowing him to stand up upright whilst carrying objects, enemies, or up to four ray guns. Okay. Strafing. Oh. Okay, so we can strafe, but that's fucking weird. So hold L or R2 button and then push left or right. What? Secrets. There are secrets. Fire rays, lift throw. It doesn't actually say. Ah, oh, speed burst. All right. Okay, so there we go. So there's our strafe. Got ya. All right, that's not actually too bad, to be fair. All right, well, let's go collect some more DNA. Ooga booga. Those totes actually fill up our health quite a lot, and they seem to be fairly common. Oh god, the hellish... Hello, buddy! Ah, there we go, there's our strafe. That's going to make combat much easier. The red DNA are worth extra to me, 626. Watch out for them. Alright, Jamba, we're on it, we're on it. Wish... Ah, we can strafe. Okay, we can strafe when we're not looking at enemies. Which is cool. Red DNA, you say? Oh, fuck. Whoa, whoa, mistakes were made. Okay, no penalty for death, I'm guessing. Doesn't seem to be. All right. And we can't destroy those weird little critters that are running around either. So far, I would imagine, if you were a fan of this back in the day, if you really enjoyed it, uh, the film, of course, I'm referring to. You would probably like this. I mean, hell, I'm enjoying it now, so, you know. Excellent day! Right, let's go. Let's go, Daddy-o. Oh, careful, 626. Uh, there we are. Don't want to get bouldered now. Alright, well, can we destroy these boulders? I'm guessing not. I also don't know how we upgrade our guns. Probably find some. Oh, that's one game that I was kind of thinking of whilst playing this. Do you remember Fur Fighters? 
Now, Fur Fighters did come out on the PlayStation 2, but it was nowhere near as good as the Dreamcast version. Uh, I remember playing it on the PlayStation 2 quite a few years after the Dreamcast had died, Fur Fighters, and, like, the frame rate was horrible. I believe the graphics were slightly different. They had been enhanced slightly, but the game lagged up so much. Right, so, guessing we can't go up there with all the boulders. Having said that, the camera seems to have locked onto that, but we're going to ignore that for now. Let's keep going this way. Nice, we have more alien meat. Just what the... Oh, fuck my ass. Hey, pal. Suck my laser. Yeah, the controls. Uh, okay, they're not bad. Oh, nice. Oh, double the firepower, double the fun. Can we kill these little things? I guess not. That's a shame. You know, those little red crab things, they all those little red flying beetle things, they remind me of uh, Buzz Bombers from Sonic. Yeah, 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 we got it, buddy. We've played video games once or twice before. Nice. Let's grab the meat. The meat seems like magnetically uh, attracted to you as well, which is quite cool. I'm a fan of that. Not sure what destroying these totems does, if anything. So, probably not going to bother. Oh man, it's so weird, like the controls on the analog stick. Okay, so if we click the right stick in, it centers us. It doesn't center the camera. It centers our character. It centers 626. Which is a bit weird. Look around you, 626. Is DNA the basis for all my experiments? Uh -huh. Go and collect me samples from this world. Yes. Boss. I can do that. So these are just giving us little tutorial tips. That's cool. Alright, let's fuck everything up, Stitch. That could be one of the squids of the ancients, legend says. You know, they'll lead you to great treasure. Oh, uh, no, wait, no. That looks like a generic robo squid bot. We'll follow it. Yes, boss. A generic robo squid bot. What are you talking about? I saw nothing of the sort. I think he's talking shit, guys. Well, that's fine. I'll tell you another one that I actually quite liked. Ah, uh, oh, fuck, fuck. Tie the Tasmanian Tiger. I remember that being quite good. That actually got a steam release. Oh, there's that's what he's talking about. Uh, oh god. Um, um, camera, 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 camera. Okay. Uh, I wish there was a way of locking onto this guy. Yeah, the camera is really not. Nice. Right, go on, buddy. Let's see what secrets you hide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's just like taking us here. So if we shoot him, he uh, disappears, which kind of makes sense. You know, he's going to be a little bit salty. Ooh. Okay. Um. You exceed even my expectations, 626. Well, you know. Reels to unlock secrets in the game. Okay. Uh, we're stuck under the stuff. I'm enjoying how s fluid this game is. The controls definitely haven't aged very well. But the gameplay seems okay. Alright, well, I think we've cleared this place out. Jump again while in the air to go. Yeah, we know, we know. All right, that's fine. Uh, 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 that. There we are. Yeah, I wouldn't say the controls are tight, but they're perfectly fine. Oh, what was? That? Oh, we got another gun. We got like three lasers. Excelente. Nice. So we got some more DNA. Oh, hello, pal. Yeah, we got three times the fun now. Wow, we're just like shredding those guys. Like, no fucks given at all. Um, okay. Yeah, visually, I, I'm impressed. You know, for a 2002 release on the on the uh, PS2, yeah, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, come on, you. 
Dude, I can't get up there, man. Can I? Can we climb? Okay, I guess we can climb. I mean, that's cool. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Alright, Stitch. Ugh, let's go back, buddy. Oh, God. Oh, man, there's loads of those guys. I guess full damage isn't a thing, which makes sense, because Stitch is supposed to be, like, invincible. Or nearly invincible, anyway. Six to six. Is not a good idea to swim in pools of acid. No shit. Use your claws to climb your way past these obstacles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we got it. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, okay. This is bad. This is really bad. Okay, maybe the controls are going to be a little bit of a... Uh, little bit of a thorn in our side. Right now. Got some more DNA. Good. Oh, we actually, like, attached to these. Okay, oh fuck nuts. That's kind of good to know, I suppose. Right, let's just destroy all of these. Yes, more meat. Give me the meat. That sounds wrong, doesn't it? But if that sounds wrong, I don't want to be right. Okay, oh, uh, yeah, yeah, come on. <laughs> I love the way he scuttles about. Um, now. Where are you going? Oh, you're going like backwards. Okay, that's fine. Where are you going with your magical pixie dust? Ooh, hello. Hey, hey, that's bullshit. You should n Oh, God. Okay. Oh, oh, fuck. Ooh. Okay, so we got another reel, just where the other one was as well, which is cool. That's fine, that's fine. We can roll with that. Could really use some more health. Having said that, dying in this game doesn't really do anything, so we don't have to worry too much about that. Alright, let's grab you. Uh, now, where was that other little dude? Come to me! Go! Go, my friend! Six to six. Is not a good idea to swim in pools of acid. We're not swimming in pools of acid, douchebag. Yeah, I know. I'm doing it. I'm doing it, buddy. Oh, God. Where's he going? Hey. He's pulling a fast one on me. Um, Stitch, come on, buddy. Are oh, you? Oh, God. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. This is not going to be good. You know, it's okay. Oh, when you die, you lose a gun. Ah, I see. That makes sense. There has to be some kind of penalty. We lose firepower. Six to six. Yeah, you keep telling me not to acid. swim in the pools of acid. And I say, I do what I want, steps. buddy. Come on, there we go. Can we have a better camera angle, please? Yeah, this camera angle is going to kick us in the dick all the way, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh man, the camera angle is the camera is going to be our biggest enemy in this. I already know it. That's actually really unfortunate. Cuz the game itself is fun. Maybe it's something we could get used to, I suppose. Who knows? Ooh, there we go. Don't you say it. Don't you regurgitate that bloody text again. All right, let's go down here. Uh, oh god. He just scurries all over the place. Uh, nope, nope. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Alright. Uh, just keep collect it's so weird. He just like as soon as you touch the stick, he just darts off. In that direction. Oh god. Oh, oh. Impressive. Yeah, not bad, eh? Not bad, Mr. Jumba. Ew. I was... Oh, hello. We don't want to miss out on precious DNA now, do we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, ooh. So how do we get down there? Now, is there a way of... Yeah, I guess we... Ah, I see. That's fine. I mean, I guess we can kind of just jump like a boss. Ooh. Nice. Back up to three guns. Cool. Alright, this is going to be 
dodgy as frick, isn't it? Oh, and then we're going to have to scale these branches again. God damn it. Oh, you, that camera is going to get us killed. The trouble is, after a while, it automatically resets itself. Doesn't matter what you're doing. And when it resets itself, it totally changes the direction of the controls. Right. Ooh, that's very, very amateur stuff. Oh, hello. Well, at least we don't have to go all the way back. We seriously need some meat. Oh, fuck. Man, it's so sketch when you jump. Okay. Oh, we can climb down this. Nice. Oh, I didn't realize those crystals were going to kill us. <gasps> We've got four guns. Whoa, whoa. 626 is best there is. Yeah, you're not wrong there. Being damn near invincible certainly helps. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on, kill it. There we go. I mean, to be fair, there's lots of health around as well. Ooh. Okay, so not only are they rewards, you can just collect those. That's quite nice. There's lots of DNA there as well. More meat. Now, will the meat disappear? Well, I don't know if it's going to disappear, but it kind of gets pulled towards us regardless. Alright. So, where are we going now? Hey, buddy. Oh, ooh. So, these are not all the same. This one has a very tight time limit on it. Let's grab the DNA. And grab you. Come on, my little friend. Ooh, that was close. That was close. We're going to miss it. Yeah, we just missed it. Oh, God. No, Stitch. Brother. Right, how can we center the camera to what we're looking at? If we even can. Okay. Okay, we, I know how to do that now. Cool. So, yeah, that's... Okay, that's better. It's not brilliant, but... Oh, you bastard. It's better. Okay, come on. Come on. No, no. Ooh. This is gonna be tight. Alright. It doesn't feel like it's a twin stick game. It feels like it was made for one stick. And then kind of adapted to two because i tell you what it is oh god oh god oh no i don't know how we're gonna do this with this game's controls oh we can walk with the d-pad which okay is okay i suppose all right and yeah so as soon as we recenter the camera he stops which is worth noting. Don't worry about it. Don't don't worry. Oh fuck my ass. This is gonna be hard. Ow. This is gonna be hard. Um, let's go grab up this DNA and then. I'm guessing that's like the exit of the level. But we're not done yet. It seems a bit weird that we only get that much DNA. Yeah, I don't think... Yeah, yeah. Tapping that button to recenter the camera just totally reverses the controls. Come on. Yes! Oh, fuck. Where's he gone now? Ah. Oh. I hope we get something good for getting these. Okay. I think I might know. Oh, I was going to say, I think I might know a way around it, but I don't. Ah, oh, you bastard. But maybe not. Unless we can come back to old worlds with uh, new gear. That's definitely possible, I suppose. Right. Come on. 
Oh, man. Maybe if we just jump across the acid instead of trying to use the platforms. Because the platforms that screw us over, at least I think, might be better off just tanking some of the damage. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that, I mean, that kind of works in a way. Yep, yep, yep. yep. It just screws you over so much by trying to change the camera. Come on. Is there any camera options? There has to be camera options. Uh, I guess not. Yeah, so that's going to be the biggest downfall of this game. Like, if the camera was better, like if it worked like an actual proper twin stick camera setup, this game would probably have got a lot more points. But it's, yeah, I mean, that's the biggest problem with the game. It, it's so hard to control. Like, Stitch is so quick and the camera cannot keep up with him. I'm going to die there on purpose. And there's some DNA there that we haven't got. Alright, let's destroy that. Oh, there's actually quite a bit of DNA we haven't got. Say, so there's, there's got to be, in theory... Oh, fuck. Logic would say... Like, 50 DNA, maybe? That makes more sense than like 48, but who knows? Okay, right, we're good, we're good, we're golden, we're golden. Trying to get used to the way the game controls. Oh, fuck. Like, why is it looking straight down, for instance? See what I mean with the camera? It's very hard to explain. That's the trouble with the camera. It is just very hard to explain a bad camera. Because you don't know what I'm doing. Like, with the controls. But the left, uh, or the right analog stick. All the right... Oh, whoa. Okay. So all the right analog stick does, like, if you move it, is it just flips it right round to the back of Stitch. It doesn't keep going like it should. So you can't use it in the same way you would any other 3D game. And I could understand if, like, camera systems like Ratchet and Clank's were new at the time, but they weren't. Come on. Ah, oh, man. I don't want to die. Like, dying takes me way too far back. It's almost like a detriment to recent the camera you just you're better off just like you shouldn't have to stop running to recenter the camera okay there we go oh we got it we got it we got it So, I'm guessing we've left some DNA here somewhere, because we've got... We've got 48 DNA. Unless... Ah! <laughs> oh, no way! No way, there's got to be like one DNA somewhere. Oh, hang on. Yeah, there we go. So, we missed two reels. And we missed one DNA. So there's a total of 900 DNA and 105 reels. Alright. That's cool. At least it gives you a tally. It tells you where you are. I like that. Oh, what was she called? Grand something. Okay. What are we on? 34. Should we have another? You can return to Let's go have a look at uh, another level. Stitch in his drool.
Loading times are a little bit long, but I suppose nothing too out of the ordinary. <clears throat> Ooh. Make your way back with the DNA, 626. Pay no mind to the hatchlings. They're start of new experiments. Uh oh, hatchlings. Not good. Six to six. You can throw those at enemies. <laughs> well, these. Okay, that's kind of cool, I suppose, but I don't really know why. Oh, we can blow his stuff up. Ooh, this is cool. Very interesting. So we can actually, uh, like, blow up Jumba's equipment. Shame he doesn't have his rather... F Ooh. Ah. No, 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 we can kill it. That's cool. Shame he's not wearing his very fetching shirt. <laughs> That's cool. I like it. Come on. Alright. Not bad. You can look around using the right stick. Hey, don't you go telling me about that analog stick, alright? We're not happy about your analog sticks. Your analog stick implementation is weird and amateur. Jump again while in the air. Yeah, you've already told us that in the last level, mate. Oh, uh, uh. This level looks a little bit more linear, I guess. Oh, fuck. Okay, that stuff really kills you quick. Good to know. These are quite fun. Oh, apart from that bit. That's fine. I was just about to say, we're not getting a lot of meat here. Oh, fuck. Um. <laughs> and here we are. We're getting loads of meat. Mm. So we can't use, like, DNA points to upgrade or anything. Which I thought we might be able to. Um. Aha! I thought as much. Give me that damn DNA. Give me. Stitch demands it. Uh oh. Whoa. What the nuggets? No, no, stitch, stitch. This way. Come on. There we go. Ah, that was stressful. Come on, good boy. Good boy, he's a good experiment. Mr. Destroyer of Worlds. Okay, so he can actually climb the conveyor belts. Uh, but I don't know. I wish I could explain how awful this is to control. And, man, it's such a shame. It's such a shame that they couldn't spend a bit more time on the... Because I don't even know what's going on. It's such a shame. Come on. Okay. Uh, all right. Come on, why can't you get up there now? Why are you no listen, Stitch? So that's that's the way we came. There we go. Right, now, if we turn around, we go all the way back up here. No! No! No, Stitch! You fool! Okay. I'm getting pretty tired of this, I'm going to be honest. Okay. You need to get, like, enough of a run-up. But sometimes he just doesn't get high. Oh, man. It's when the camera angle just automatically, like, auto-centers, it totally fucks your controls. Like, what would be a straightforward jump is now a jump to the left. There we go. So now where are we going? Okay. Yeah, we got this, buddy. We got this. All right. Uh, Stitch, why why did you no grab? Why did you no grab, Stitch? It's 
stitch. You're meant to be grabbing things. Like that. Uh. <sighs> okay, I'm actually going to give up on this one. The controls just ruin it completely. What a shame. Because the game is okay. It's fairly serviceable. You know, if you gave this to a kid back in the day... And the controls work. You'd probably be quite happy. In fact, I'm sure quite a few kids probably were quite happy with this game. But I could also see him, like, smashing the PlayStation 2 to pieces out of frustration with the controls. A bit of a shame, to be honest. But uh, anyway, guys, so that is Lilo and Stitch. Oh, no, it's just called Stitch Experiment 626. Hmm. I'd actually have liked to have seen a little bit more of this. Perhaps when the missus comes down next month, I might actually sit down and play it with her. Perhaps. It might be more fun if we're playing it together. But Yeah. Disappointing. Very disappointing. Um, in all the stuff I read about the game, I never read anything about the controls, really. But then I didn't really read that much about the game. Hmm. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, till next time.